Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. In the Word 2003 and Word XP versions, you also have a new feature of the task pane, and this is the area over on the right side of the screen. We use this area in Word to create new documents, open old documents, store items that we've cut or copied to the clipboard, create our mail merge documents, and also insert clip art. And this area changes depending on what task you're performing. If you don't want the task pane to be up while you're working, you can close it by clicking the X in the upper right corner of the task You can bring it back by choosing View from the menu bar and selecting Task Pane. You can voluntarily change what view of the task pane you're seeing on screen by clicking the drop down arrow that appears next to the pane's title at the top of the task pane and then selecting one of the available pane views from the menu of choices that appears. The view with the check in front of its name is the currently selected task pane view. Also, if you don't want the task pane to appear every time you start Word XP, there is a small checkbox at the bottom of the task pane that says Show at Startup that you could easily uncheck. In 2003, you had to do the same thing by selecting Tools, rolling all the way down to Options, and giving it a click. In the Options dialog box, you could select the View tab, and then deselect the Startup Task Pane checkbox to turn the task pane off so it wouldn't display every time you started Word. You could then click OK at the bottom of the Options box when you were done. Also, while you can close it by clicking the X in the upper right corner of the task pane, you can also toggle it off by choosing the same command we used to turn it on, View and Task Pane. So once again, this is a toggle command that we can use to both turn it on or turn it off. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.